What's up everybody? It's Kevin back with another reaction video. We are finally going to get to the song The Story of One Sky. Uh, I am going to have the filter on this because it is copyrighted. So if you guys are familiar with the song or you want to follow along in your own way or check out the video itself afterwards, I will leave the link to this video in the description box. Uh, I'm interested in this one. It's 13 minutes and 40 seconds long and uh, I got my morning coffee and this is a special day for me because I am, this is my final day at my current job and I am about to begin a new job next week. So uh, I thought I would share that happiness and everything with you guys by doing the story of one sky which has uh, been requested by pretty much everybody so uh, let's get to it and uh, sorry for the ads throughout at a 13 minute song I think we're gonna have a couple ads so I'll pause those uh, and uh, we'll get through them together okay So before we start, I uh, I know that some people have commented, and I've noticed it in a few of Dimash's songs, but uh, there is definitely a theme with water in some of his songs, and uh, this one starts out uh, just like that. So um, good start visually for us. It seems like a good opportunity to pause here. Really good stuff so far. So obviously we get this guy who looks to be a general or uh, some sort of leader of uh, some sort of, I don't know, war, uh, who has saved uh, someone from drowning. 
And uh, obviously that token, you can see he's been given the token by the person who was almost drowned uh, because it's slightly bent. So here he is in the future. Um, the lyrics of this are wonderful. Like this is, um, uh, this is a very real song. I mean, he says that, uh, you know, Dimash says about um, us causing pain, like us as human beings and kind of doing wrong to the womb that gave us life. So interpret that how you will. Uh, I kind of interpret it as uh, us doing harm to earth and uh, everything that earth has given us with life and everything. And we are destroying it with war and uh, sadness and not being good to one another. So really good subject matter here. Uh, video itself is truly fascinating. Um, I can totally see why people have wanted to see this video and uh, have people react to it because um, <laughs> there's a lot to it. I mean, 13 minutes, 40 seconds. We're going to see a heck of a lot more, I'm sure. But really, really good stuff here, both lyrically and visually. And uh, we will continue. It's just his Can we balance all that of So we got some ads here. I'm going to uh, just mute it throughout the ad and uh, we're going to skip it. And I'm just going to pause there because it seems like a good opportunity. But this is just really good stuff. So obviously we see Dimash here. Dimash is playing a soldier. Uh, I am going to assume Dimash is the person who almost drowned at the beginning of the video. Uh, and he is kind of opposing the friend who saved him. Um, really interesting stuff here. Uh, there's somebody who's trying to kind of like uh, have like a one world government or not be able to give people the choice to live and be free. And um, I mean, really good stuff. I really like this video so far. It kind of reminds me of like a, a Saving Private Ryan or something like that, but uh, with a pretty awesome song to go along with it. So let's continue. Yeah, we have passed the moment of Okay, before we probably start seeing some more shooting and everything, obviously there's uh, Dimash is holding up his his token from the beginning, and uh, we are seeing a girl holding her token with her daughter in her hands. So I will make the assumption that this is Dimash's wife and uh, uh, Dimash's daughter, at least in the song, anyways. And uh, and it, it kind of fits with it. It's so obviously there's three people at the beginning of this video. One has turned to war, and the other turned. Uh, the other two have fallen in love, or embraced love in general. So really, really good stuff. Um, yeah, like I don't know. Like visually, this this video is uh, is quite good, and uh, I'm definitely digging it so far. And uh, I think it's fairly easy to follow along. But uh, correct me in the comment section if I'm wrong here.
All right. Um, so obviously you see a little girl holding her bear, which was very important to her. Something that she loved near and dear, and there's a soldier coming towards her. I don't know why, uh, but if you guys have seen the movie Schindler's List, this one just kind of um, reminded me of that movie, which is, uh, for the most part, I believe, in black and white, uh, except for one scene where there, where Oscar Schindler is sitting on a horse at the top of a hill, and he sees this little girl dressed in pink. And uh, she stands out because she's pink in a movie that's black and white. And later on in the movie, he is seeing all these people that have been massacred and brutalized with... Uh, um, you know, World War Two, and uh, he comes across a dead body with a girl in pink. And um, I don't know. I don't know why that really struck with me or what it kind of reminded me of, but um, it did. And uh, that's why I guess you guys are here to see someone's reaction and comments about it. So uh, really, really good stuff. I hope we do see that little girl and I hope we do she did survive this. But uh, that's a reality of war, uh, unfortunately. And that's one of the things that makes war just absolutely inexcusable in many ways so um let's continue This video is absolutely intense, and uh, <laughs> I don't know if I was prepared for it, so um, great stuff anyways, but very, very intense. Just before Dimash gets back into it, um, obviously we have discovered, or Dimash has discovered that his daughter, or even if it's not his daughter, some young innocent little girl has uh, is the victim of this war that's taking place. And um, yeah, I don't know. I guess uh, definitely a song that uh, I probably 
should have prepared for more mentally um, because that video definitely uh, this video is very interesting but definitely um, not the happiest of videos uh, but uh, you know that's the reality of war that there's always going to be innocent people that are dying and no matter what the cause is whether they think you know whether the, the leaders think it's right or wrong um, there's always casualties and there's always people that don't deserve it that are going to be victims of it so um, anyways I'll try to try to bring myself up here but uh, definitely a powerful part of the song and the video itself <laughs> Also, right before we get to the lyrics, I just want to say how great it is and just shows the ability of Dimash because I don't think there's been any lyrics for the last two minutes or so in this song, but everything he's doing with his voice captivates you. It keeps you enthralled uh, and just a testament to the um, many abilities of this man. So uh, let's get back to it because I believe he's about to start again. <laughs> All right, there is so much to dissect in this video, and I am probably overlooking a lot of things. I feel like I should have watched this video two or three times and uh, really grasped everything that's going on. But um, obviously, Dimash, as well as, I'm just going to call him the bad guy. Uh, the bad guy are dead now, um, and, uh, and there's a theme in this song, we are choosing life. And uh, as they die, there is a baby being born. So that rebirth, that, you know hey, now that this war is over, we are all choosing life and hopefully the war is over forever and we can live under one sky and be tolerant, respectful of one another and live our lives in peace and harmony without war. So uh, that's what I'm getting from this. Obviously, this is a very layered video and definitely could be interpreted many ways to many people. Uh, I think we would all probably share somewhat the same opinion of this video in that sense of what it's trying to get across. Um, I really love this theme too i mean like I, I chose a good time to pause it obviously with what's on the screen but you got different religions and different beliefs all coming together walking up a hill together as one uh in the most positive of a ways right so really really good stuff here and um yeah i can see why this has been recommended so much this is a very power powerful video and song itself <laughs>
Yep. <sighs> what a good message. Everything that's on the screen right now is so powerful and real and something that we need to consider a lot more. And the powers that be and those in charge really need to not only check out this video, but uh, really dissect what's on the screen right now. Um, obviously, Dimash has died in this video. He has been shot. However, <laughs> he's kind of like an angel. He's leading us. And uh, in many ways, that is totally layered because this is the type of song that really should lead people to um, tolerance and love. And in many ways, he is that piper that's leading the way. And um, beautiful, beautiful stuff. I love how many different religions are, are represented here. You can see them on the screen. Um, being tolerant and accepting of people. Um, I don't really care I, what your what your beliefs are politically. Uh, I don't care what your religious beliefs are. If you're a good person, you're a good person. And I'm going to be nice to you and I'm going to respect you for who you are. Um, we all have something that makes us happy and who are we to take away from that? So if someone's belief is, um, <laughs> you know, if someone believes in something that you don't, well, you know what, accept the fact that they're probably still a good person to you. And uh, if they're not, then that you don't have time for them, but uh, we don't need to make war. We don't need to um, push our beliefs on other people. We just need to accept people a heck of a lot more. And I think that that's really one of the things that's lacking in the world. Uh, in many ways, we needed someone like Dimash. And I think in my personal life as well, uh, I needed to discover Dimash when I did. Um, just truly beautiful stuff here. I uh, This video really is wonderful. The lyrics to this song is one, are wonderful. Uh, the song itself is wonderful. But it is very tough to really take away from everything when there's such a powerful video on the screen. So uh, kudos to everybody involved in making this video as well as the song. I know at the beginning I, I didn't catch the girl's name who did the lyrics. But Dimash is obviously the composer. And it really works. So... Uh, great stuff here. Thank you all for your patience. Uh, like I said, I, I have the filter on. So um, if you are just checking this reaction video out and haven't heard this song or watched the video, I highly recommend clicking on the link in the description box because this video you have to see for yourself. And um, I think this is a, a very moving experience checking this out. So uh, I'm going to continue the last 27 seconds in case I missed anything, but I don't think I did. No, so that's it. So again, wonderful stuff here. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one. This is a lengthy video and uh, I don't have any videos. I've been trying to cut them shorter to under or around 10 minutes, uh, but this is something you can't rush and it's a 13 minute 40 second song. So I wanted to pause as frequently as possible to really dissect and engage in, in what I'm seeing on the screen and how I'm interpreting this song. So. Please comment in the comment section and let me know what you guys think of this one. Hope you guys all have yourselves a wonderful day. Be good to one another. Tolerate one another. Love one another. And uh, we will be talking to you all very, very soon. Bye for now.